ever pondered on the sophistication of ancient civilizations, particularly their ability to predict astronomical events like eclipses? Well, the secret lies in an intricate cosmic dance known as the Saros Cycle. It's a fascinating concept, steeped in history and astronomical observation. The Saros Cycle was discovered by the Babylonians, an ancient civilization renowned for their prowess in astronomy. This was an era before telescopes, calculators or computers. They observed the cosmos with their naked eyes, meticulously recording their observations on clay tablets. These tablets, thousands of years old, serve as the earliest known records of systematic astronomical observations. The Babylonians noticed a pattern in the frequency of lunar and solar eclipses. After countless observations and careful calculations, they discovered that eclipses occur in a repeating pattern every 18 years and 11 days, a period now known as the Saros Cycle. But what exactly is the Saros Cycle? It's a complex interplay between the Sun, Earth and Moon. The cycle begins when the Sun and Moon are at the same position in the sky, a new moon. Over the course of the Saros Cycle, the Sun and Moon slowly drift apart until, after 18 years, and 11 days, they are once again at the same position, marking the start of a new cycle. The Babylonians used this knowledge to predict future eclipses. By recording the date and time of each eclipse, they could calculate when the next one would occur. If an eclipse happened today, they knew that another one would occur 18 years and 11 days later. But the Sado cycle isn't perfect. It's not exactly 18 years and 11 days, but about a third of a day longer. This means that each eclipse in a Saros series occurs about 8 hours later than the previous one. This slight discrepancy was known to the Babylonians, who adjusted their predictions accordingly. To summarize, the Saros cycle is a period of approximately 18 years and 11 days, during which eclipses occur in a repeating pattern. This pattern was discovered by the Babylonians, who used it to predict future eclipses. The cycle is not exact, but close enough that it served as a reliable tool for predicting eclipses thousands of years ago. Today, modern astronomers use sophisticated mathematical models to predict eclipses, but the Saro cycle remains a useful tool. Despite its slight inaccuracy, it provides a simple way to understand the repetition of lunar and solar eclipses. It's a testament to the astronomical knowledge of the ancient Babylonians and a fascinating example of how careful observation can reveal the mysteries of the cosmos. So the next time you witness the celestial spectacle of an eclipse, remember the Saros cycle, the ancient Babylonians, and the intricate cosmic dance that brings this awe-inspiring event to our skies.